Let's find the oxidation numbers for each element here in P2O5. This is actually an empirical formula. This compound here will be found as P4O10, but let's just do this one, find these oxidation numbers here. So when we find the oxidation numbers, this is a neutral compound because there's no negative or positive number. So a neutral compound, all the oxidation numbers, they add up to zero. So that's helpful. When we look at something like this, phosphorus, we're not sure, but oxygen, is almost always negative too, except when it's with fluorine or in peroxides. So each one of these oxygens has a negative two oxidation number. So the question is, what is the oxidation number on each phosphorus? You might be able to tell that five times negative two, that's negative 10. So up here for X, we're gonna have to have a positive five so that these oxidation numbers, they'll all add up to zero. Two times plus five, that's plus 10. 5 times negative 2, that's negative 10. So everything adds up to 0, and those are the oxidation numbers for each element here in P2O5. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.